Now to this one, big dreams to bring big development to business in Citrus Heights. There's a new push to transform the rundown Sunrise Mall into the community's new central hub with a main street, hotels, housing, and more. Yeah, it's a push that's been happening for quite some time. Your reporter covering Sacramento County, Tori Abadaka. There she is live from there with more on the plan. Tori. Hey, yeah, the city of Citrus Heights is really hopeful for the type of economic boom that this reimagined space could bring to the area, calling it Sunrise Commons. But you can see here that there are some shoppers going into the mall right now, but you can see the parking lot is pretty desolate. A lot of people we've been talking with say they kind of just enjoy the simplicity of this mall, even though they've been watching it go downhill for years. It's kind of sad and uh, pathetic and depressing. Vacant store after vacant store and a practically vacant parking lot. And it's dormant. It's like, what? What happened to this mall? The Sunrise Mall in Citrus Heights, no longer the neighborhood shopping destination it once was. Back then, I mean, you couldn't even find a parking space. Now there's almost too many spots to choose from, but half the mall inside gated off. Two department stores helping the nearly 100 acre space survive. Look at the silly trees. <laughs> it's like another uh, reminder of like uh, how desolate this place is. But the city of Citrus Heights's Sunrise Tomorrow specific plan will transform this mall into a modern day multi-use destination. Early renderings showing high rise buildings, outdoor common use areas, hotels and housing. I'm excited to have more options, um, not excited for the crowds that it might bring. The 20 year long plan is laid out in four phases, starting with redeveloping the old Sears building into a dining entertainment district, retail, hotel and open space area. Well, it concerns me a little bit. That's why creating paths and streets to make it easy to walk and bike around are all part of the plan that the city approved in 2021. Definitely potential. Ambitious dreams for a desolate mall. But they won't happen without the cooperation of the Sunrise Mall's multiple property owners. I don't believe in anything, nothing, until something really concrete comes up. So right now there is no plan to actually demolish the mall. The city of Citrus Heights says that a lot of this project is instead going to be focused on using the 75 acres of surplus parking and you can just see how much space there is here. As far as this plan though, the city says that it does not actually own this property. So I reached out to the property owners but haven't heard back about what their ideas are moving forward for this plan.